Prince Harry has always been likened to Princess Diana's side of the family, namely for his red hair which is a Spencer trait. Looking at Diana's older sister Lady Sarah McCorkadale, it's clear that Harry has inherited his hair color from his mother's side, but the Duke of Sussex also bears an uncanny resemblance to his grandfather on his dad's side of the family, Prince Philip. Photos of a young Philip show a striking similarity between the two. Harry appears to be a carbon copy of his grandfather, bearing the same piercing clear eyes, strong brow, slender nose and thin lips. Harry started showing a likeness to the Duke of Edinburgh from a very young age, when he was a teenager and shared the same mannerisms and expressions. Like the Queen's husband, Harry spent years of his life dedicated to the army. He served in the armed forces for 10 years and was deployed to Afghanistan twice, while his grandfather Prince Philip boasted a formidable military career in his time. At 21 years old, Philip was one of the youngest first lieutenants in the Royal Navy and went on to serve during World War II. He grew a full beard while out at sea, a far cry from his normally clean-shaven look. Harry, meanwhile, has been sporting a beard since 2013 when he completed a charity trek to the South Pole with Walking with the Wounded. The Queen reportedly told him to shave it off, with an insider at the time saying, she doesn't mind royal men growing beards when they are away in the armed forces or out in the wilds like Harry was in the Antarctic, but she expects them to be clean-shaven when they get home. Harry shaved off his beard in the New Year, despite his girlfriend of the time Cressida Bonas reportedly liking the look. But after the prince left the army in June 2015, he went back to growing a beard and has kept one ever since. Of course, the similarities don't end there. Harry and Philip also share a wicked sense of humor. Princess Diana's son is well known for his cheeky personality, especially when he teams up with big brother Prince William, the Duke of Edinburgh. Meanwhile, has a reputation for his sharp one-liners. It was previously revealed that the Queen was advised not to marry him because courtiers thought he was too funny.